If you are still ignoring Samsung Notes in 2026, you are seriously missing out. This app just changed everything. Not only it's one of the best free note-taking apps in the market, but the new Galaxy AI features will make your life so much easier. We will get to that in a moment, but before that, the biggest drawback of Samsung Notes is that, well, it's Samsung Notes. You can only access this app if you have a Samsung device. I've been using it with my Galaxy Tab S9 FE Plus, the S10 FE and my S25 Ultra. And honestly, here's why Samsung Notes might just be the best note-taking app for Android. My my name is Prithviraj and let's dive right in. First things first, Samsung Notes is a completely free app and it's designed to work seamlessly with Samsung devices. The other note-taking apps often come with a price tag or subscription fees for comparable features, whereas Samsung Notes will have us covered in almost every aspect without costing a single penny. But it's not just about being free. Samsung Notes combines text-based as well as handwritten notes in a way that feels very natural. And there is one aspect where Samsung Notes excels over all other note-taking apps and that is in terms of hardware. We get the S Pen right out of the box with Samsung tablets as well as on the ultra smartphones. This means Samsung Notes is completely optimized for the S Pen. And this, my friend, is a total game changer. Apart from Apple Notes on the iPad, no other note-taking app can match this level of hardware software integration. And not to forget the new Galaxy AI features, they are fully optimized for Samsung Notes as well. Hence, they work in sync and can really help you elevate your overall productivity. But before we dive into all those AI features, let's cover the basics first. Starting with the UI of Samsung Notes, the interface is very clean and minimal, and to top it off, it's super user-friendly. I've mentioned this in my past videos as well, simplicity is often the most important aspect of any note-taking app. Everything is laid out right in front of you with a very well-organized layout. We can create and organize notes into folders and easily navigate across our notes using the sidebar. The folder structure is fantastic. You can create folders and even subfolders, and then drag and drop things into place. It all sits in the hamburger menu on the left side. You can color code your folders for easy navigation, which makes finding specific notes super quick. Now, once you're inside a note, you can find all your required tools in the toolbar right here. We have the pen tool, eraser tool, highlighter, lasso tool, and all other stuff up here. Let us talk about the pen options first. We have a solid variety of pen types to choose from, each with its own unique feel and purpose. There is the standard pen, the fountain pen for that classic writing feel, the brush pen, which is my personal favorite, as the strokes feels real smooth and natural and the highlighter of course for emphasizing important points. Each pen types can be customized with different thickness and colors. You can choose from a preset color palette or create your own custom colors to match your note taking style. The eraser also comes with options. You can erase stroke by stroke or use the area eraser to clear a large section of notes. This level of pen customization means you can adjust your writing experience exactly to your preferences. As I mentioned previously, it's one of the rare note taking apps that lets you take both handwritten as well as text based notes. We have a proper text app with all the require text formatting options for typing stuff down when it's necessary. Now let's talk about the S Pen, as this opens up different level of productivity within Samsung Notes. The writing feel is of course the most important aspect of any handwritten note taking app. Not only do you have the ability to take off-screen memo to quickly jot down a note, and it saves to Samsung Notes automatically, but you also have features like handwriting to text conversion, and the ability to create shapes if you wanted to draw diagrams. It will snap the shapes to proper straight lines. The writing feel here is incredible with the S Pen. It's very smooth and responsive, and I did not face any issues regarding the palm rejection aspect as well. Your palm resting on the screen won't accidentally create those lines. And there is one feature of Samsung Notes I'm literally a fan of. We have this really cool magnify button, or as Samsung calls it, the easy writing pad, where you can zoom into specific areas to make your handwriting more precise. It creates a rectangular box at the bottom of the screen where you can write large and it automatically consolidates very neatly at the top where it should go. This makes it really easy if you want to make some minor adjustments or you want some precision while writing certain stuff. This is quite a nice addition and I absolutely love that. Now let's talk about customization because this is where Samsung Notes really lets you make this app your own. First up, we have the theme and page color options. Samsung Notes offers a variety of background colors for your pages, from classic white and cream to darker options like navy blue and black. And here's the really cool part. When you change your page background color, the entire UI automatically adapts to match that color. The toolbar, the sidebar, everything adjusts to complement your chosen background. Thus, it will create a much more immersive and personalized experience. If you prefer dark mode for easier reading at night, 
it or just for the aesthetic like myself samsung notes will handle that beautifully but what i want to focus on are the templates you can select from different page layouts that samsung provides different page options like grid layout ruled dotted and the rest and we also have some unique options like this checklist view for creating to-do list else there are many timetable kind of templates in case you would like to use that or if you're a classical musician we even get a layout for sheet music which can be super helpful for those who need that the template system makes samsung notes flexible enough to be whatever you need it to be you can set up the whole app like a planner use it for academic note taking with proper structure or keep it minimal for quick thoughts and ideas if you have a samsung smartphone or a samsung computer the app syncs across all your devices seamlessly through samsung cloud this allows you to pick up from right where you left off start a note on your phone continue on your tablet and finalize that on your galaxy book it's all there synced within seconds and also please consider hitting that subscribe button if you're finding this helpful and i'll keep creating more such videos Now you can of course download and import PDFs directly inside Samsung Notes and after that you can annotate your PDFs right inside this app. This is a game changer if you're a student and you need to highlight stuff and take book notes directly within your PDF. We have the highlighter tool at our disposal to emphasize key points as I pointed out at the start and you can even jump into specific page using the navigation tool. That's a total time saver when you're working with lengthy documents and textbooks. This feature doesn't really seem significant unless you start using it and with Galaxy AI in the picture it makes much more sense now. But we'll get to that in a moment also not to forget you can drag and drop photos stickers and even add audio files right into your notes this can really make your notes pop and add a multimedia dimension to your note taking experience the audio recording part is incredibly clever you can basically attach audio files from your device or rather take voice notes right inside your notes and pdfs the microphone gets activated and it will record whatever is happening around you as you are writing down your notes for example you are in your class taking notes you can keep your voice notes on so that your lecture gets recorded as as well during that time and then later when you're playing the audio back it will give you more context to your note and show you what you were writing at that time of the voice being spoken this can be especially helpful while revising i've loaded up my daily planner template inside samsung notes every morning when i wake up i simply open up my planner template and then plan for my entire day i read this book called make time by jake knapp and john zeratsky from there i understood the concept of the daily highlight we simply have to note down our most important task for that given day that way we have a clear idea and we can achieve our goals rather easily this method helps me stay a lot more organized and accountable rather than solely using a to-do list app i highly recommend that you give this a try i'll be leaving the link of my daily planner template in the description box below the like button so in case you're interested in that please check it out there's also a weekly as well as a monthly view in that planner but now let's address the feature you have been waiting for the most Now this is one of the biggest additions of Samsung Notes, Galaxy AI. Samsung has built AI into various platforms and services, but inside Samsung Notes, it's probably the best use case for AI. Once you have got your notes taken down, or whether you have copied information into Samsung Notes, you can use the AI toolbar to activate four different functions. Let us explore them. Firstly, we can of course convert our handwritten notes into text. It even detects my ugly handwriting, so it will detect yours just fine. The precision of the conversion has improved ever since the AI integration. Next is auto format. This function takes the text you have created and formats it in a way that makes it look much more neat and thus more organized. There are two different options, meeting notes and headers and bullets. Both will give you a variation of the same thing. They sort of format it, gives you colors and structures, and then you can replace it or add into a new note. Summarize. This is where things get really powerful. You won't have to make a pit stop at ChatGPT to summarize your notes anymore. When you have a massive body of text in your notes, you can select it and use the summarization function. It will literally summarize everything for you. And again, you can replace it or add into a different note. When this comes in handy as if you're taking notes in your class or in a meeting and you just need to send cliff notes, you can simply summarize the entire thing and send it off without having to read through everything yourself. Let AI take care of that for you. Translate. This will translate your notes into different language, pretty self-explanatory as you can see. So if you are studying foreign languages, this can be useful. We of course have spell check and grammar corrections or proofreading as you might call it. This will read through the document you have created and then correct it for any grammatical mistakes or spellings. These Galaxy AI features have genuinely transformed how I interact with my notes, making them smarter and more useful without taking any extra effort from my part. Samsung is also working on expanding the math solver feature. This will let you write mathematical equations by hand and get instant solutions. So this makes it perfect for students. It's still in beta, so it's not rolled out officially, but I'll make an update when it drops out. So stay tuned for that.
In conclusion, Samsung Note in 2026 is more than just a note taking app. It's a powerhouse productivity tool and has set a new standard for Android tablets and smartphones. From its clean UI and versatile note taking options, along with the new Galaxy AI features, Samsung Notes truly has it all. The S Pen integration remains unmatched on Android, giving you a hardware software combination that just works seamlessly. And the fact that it's free and it's completely optimized for the Samsung ecosystem, this will make it your go to choice to be honest, especially if you're a long term Samsung user. Thus, I'll have to say Samsung Notes really deserves your attention in 2026 as well. It's still the king, no questions about that. We previously discussed about how I use Samsung Notes to plan out my entire life, and that thing really helps me stay organized and super productive every day. Click here on this video, and over there, I've shared my daily planning system in more detail. And trust me on this one, doing this every day will definitely help you stay a lot more productive. See you there.